Okay, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Can everyone hear me? Does everything sound okay? Who have we got in the chat already? We've got a Sami. How you doing, Sami? Long time no speak. Leslie. Burnt Cookies, Wolf Games. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Yeah, my stream was saying that... Well, YouTube was saying my stream wasn't too healthy, but now it's gone back to green, so I'm hoping we'll be alright. I'm hoping, anyway. But let me know if you have any issues. Hello, Jim Harris. Hello. Hey, Geeky, the new graduate. Congratulations again, by the way. New layout? What do you mean, new layout? I've moved, like, the donations and YouTube uh, notifications just to the bottom right there. That's about it. That's all I've changed, really. From the last stream, anyway. We can always move it if it gets in the way. Couldn't cope without your videos, eh? Hey, you know, not, not a problem. You'd be fine, you'd be fine. And hello, Scott. No worries, man. Hey, thanks for stopping by, no matter how long. Even if it's just a quick hello, I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Make sure everything's set up. You finally made a stream. Hey, Becca, a long time no see. How are you doing? All right. So, yeah, we're going to be picking off where we left off last time. Picking up where we left off last time. Kirby, hello, and the Raging Nerdbird. Hello, hello, hello. Spoilers, this game has blocks in it. Bricked. It does. So, yeah, I've done a little bit in between the last stream and now. As you can see, I built a little room for my, um, my, you know, workstation and anvil. Made some nice straw floor for it. I just felt like it. Um, but that's about it, really. We've harvested quite a bit more wheat, but we're about to finish that off. And then we've got to chat to Bonanza for a mission. Uh, in fact, we can talk to him now. Let's see what he has to say. Um, currently in the car for 24 hours moving across country. Holy shit. Holy shit, that is quite the trip. Yeah, stay safe. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna kill Lulu yet, sadly. She's on the other island. Um, yeah, so... Oh, and welcome, Balthazar. Hello, hello. I have no roof on my... I know, I can't really make roofs right now. I did steal some, but I don't think... Uh, I can make them unless I build, like, just more of those blocks, which I could do, I guess. But I'm fine with it the way it is right now. Well, this is just the basic blueprint, if you will. We'll elaborate on it later. Hello, Nomad! So, what we're gonna do... I'm gonna plant some of these cabbage seeds. And we're going to start harvesting all the stuff and all the things, which should get us to 50 wheat quite easily. I love that they clap here. They do. How's everyone doing anyway? I don't usually stream on a Friday. Harvest wheat color. Right, that's, that's all of the tasks done. So the tree should grow even more. Mm -hmm. Wheat has always been a symbol of prosperity here on Furrowfield. There's just so much food you can make with it. We'll never go hungry again! Especially now that you're here, Mage, I expect that your skills as a builder probably extend to making delicious dishes too. Am I going to learn some new recipes? Like literal recipes? <laughs> yeah, no, I I don't think there's a song about stealing a roof. That would be hilarious, though. That's a proper tree now, isn't it? Yay! Yaha! Haggling heel slimes, mage. You've done it. You've completed every one of the pastor's tasks. 
You have rebuilt, uh, rebuilt Furrowfield's fields and produced a bountiful harvest. The earth itself has been imbued with the power of growth. It is this that has given strength to the, de uh, to the day tree. In turn, the great tree will extend uh, the, her blessings to your farm, protecting the fruits of your labor with her holy power. Okay, then. Very astute of you, child. But now you have outlived your usefulness. Your farming career ends here. What? He's not going to kill us, is he? I jest, I jest. Keep your beard on. Which is something I've not really done. I've trimmed mine. Um, our work is not done yet. After all, there is still more we must do to see the day tree attain her true form. This isn't even her final form. Um, ah, he stole the roof. He was slated for it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I just find it easier to see what's going on in the rooms without a roof on it. Although, playing in first person is an option. If you wish to see the day tree restored to her full strength, you will have no choice but to work your fingers to the bone. Alright, so... He's going to congratulate us and then tell us what to do. <laughs> ah, jolly good. Sowing the seeds of success. You have done well to complete the tasks I have set out for you. The day tree grows, uh, goes from strength to strength. But you, builder, do not. Listen to your townsfolk, build for them. Gather the symbols of their gratitude and pour that power into the builder's bell. Uh, okay. Cool. <laughs> Even Wrigley's getting in on it. Uh, I think I'm probably... Because I did get it to level 2. Okay, maybe we'll just have to wait a little bit. We'll see what Bonanza wants. Or whatever the hell his name is. Let me finish harvesting the food. There we go. It isn't even its final form. Alright, we might as well cook some... Uh, doo -doo -doo. Ah, we've got quite a few cooked... You know what, can we cook the wheat? Yeah, we can. Let's see what we can make with that. This game looks so fun, I might have to try it. I do recommend it, Becca, I really do. It's fantastic so far. Right, let's go see what he wants. Hi, mage. I see improvements to my villager proceeding uh, apace, and your skills as a builder are improving likewise. Wonderful work, lad. Uh, as a builder-in-chief of our humble home, it falls to you, young man, to inspire us to uh, by ringing that bell. Great bell once more. Uh, is he just going to tell us to get it to level two? I don't know. Yeah, we've already done that. Grumbly ghouls, mage, it's clear your skills as a builder are greater than ever. The instant your hammer struck that bell, I felt myself overcome with creative energy. I didn't do anything, mate. I did that ye years ago. Been watching your building work with a keen eye, mage. That's creepy. Uh, by building your buildings and planting your crops, you have made our hopes and dreams a reality. So, I think we're going to get our reward. Okay. Complete. Yes, we did it. Hey, Jody. Welcome to the stream. Wonderful. Oh, Wrigley wants something. Oh, and this guy that we kidnapped wants something. Sweet. Anyone else? Oh, he just made some bread, guys. We're rolling in the dough. There we go. Alright, see what Wrigley wants. Ooh, or... Isn't it nice to have such lovely, clean soil about? Oh, well, you make him happy to help. Never thought this day would come, to be honest. If only my, <laughs> if only my old man Parker had lived to see this. Oh yeah, they're dead. That's sad. When I was just a whippersnapper, they gave me these treasures. They've been handed down through the generations, so they have. Now, Major, I want you to have them. Ooh, what have we got? We've got some balls of worm food. Wonderful. Thanks. 
Then balls of worm food are brill. Plop them down on the ground and it'll turn the area around them into lovely green grass. Oh. Cool. Right, so don't put them near the fields because that'll just get rid of the soil. Okay. Nice. So place worm food on the ground. Chuck them down on top of the spoiled soil. Okay, Does, do I have to do it? Like, uh... suppose we could do it down here, but is there any point? Where do you want me to do it? Anywhere? Or did he mean... Did he mean for us to do it, like, on here, which we've already made fields of? Huh. Well, we can try it in the ditch, can't we? I don't know. Um... Hey, Zahama! Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? And hey, Blaine Pyle Jr. Welcome to the stream. Uh... Okay, well, I guess it doesn't really matter where you do it. We'll get some nice green moat over here. Wow! <laughs> Is that Britney? Britney's your name, isn't it? Yes. Okay, cool. Let's do it over here as well. Why not? Um. Okay, cool. Oh, and by the way, yeah, another thing I did was I gave one of these guys that joined us last time, I gave them a cypress stick. So, hopefully they'll be able to help defend the farm a little bit better. Nice. Everybody's so happy. Get in, it actually worked. I made a little village green all of my own. Thanks, Ma. Thanks, Pa. Not bad, Wrigley. Uh, we came here to work out how to make the Isle of Awakening a little greener, and it looks like we found our answer. What does Rosie want? Oh, she got stuck. The green stuff on the ground. Is this grass? Wrigley, did you do all this? I certainly did. Um, yeah. Yeah, we're slowly working our way up the criminal enterprise. You're, you Wigglies are really incredible. Not only can you make the earth clean, but you can make it green as well. You're going to pay a, uh, play a key role in bringing this island back to life. I just know it. Um, I don't want to make more fields, eh? Cool. You did learn a thing or two along the way. That's the, that was the last of my worm food, but I'm sure uh, you'll work out how to make it yourself one day. I hope so, because that is pretty nice. I like green grass. A lot better than shitty spoiled soil. Cool. Alrighty ho. More stuff to harvest. Oh no, we don't. Not yet. Not yet. Alright, what do you want, Clayton? You drag me here against my will. You force me to toil in your fields. I am a devout follower of the children of Hagen. Can't you understand that this is a living hell for me? A wise and powerful master of destruction. Please have mercy onto your wayward children. What? What do you mean I looked like I was having fun when I was tilling that field? Speak for yourself, you, you builder. I love Clayton. He might be my favorite, actually. In fact, if you love building so much, builder, why don't you go ahead and build us a barn? Ooh, yeah, I'd like to build a barn. Uh, a room with a chest, a haystack, farming tools, rope, firewood, and a pot. Put it into a nice small room, I imagine, a builder like yourself. Can't help but build a huge... Okay. So we need to build a small room. Because I think the room I just built for my crafting station is technically just a step up from that. It's not a small room, it's just a room. So where are we going to build this? Where am I going to build a barn? And actually... Um, I mean, we could convert this into a barn. Couldn't we? Probably. I'd have to get rid of the bed in, perhaps. Hmm. You know what? I'm just going to build one from scratch. So, in the first builders, you were kind of limited a little bit to, like, within an area for your first village or whatever it was. 
I wonder if that's the case here, if we can sort of build anywhere we want. <clears throat> hey, Dante and Velocity! Hello! Hello, how are you doing? And Trainer Joel just came from episode 1 or 1 of Dragon Quest XI. Couldn't miss this stream, really loving the series, although I'm a bit late. My boy Eric has been on the bench for a while. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying the, uh, the Let's Play. Thank you so much for watching. And hello, Damien! I've no I, I would imagine the accents are all the same in whatever version you play. Right. Oh, night time's falling. So, I mean, I could build a barn here, actually. Let's clear some... Let's clear some space for this barn. In fact, we can just use this as a template, really. Yeah, we'll just fill in the gaps. Build it out of uh, soil for now. See if this will be good enough. Um, we'll make a regular... Oh, so that is a really small room, though. <laughs> That's, we ain't gonna fit all this shit in there. That won't be much of a barn. Um, let's, uh, let's build it out a little bit. In fact, I'm gonna get rid of this. Uh, get rid of that. Oh, no, 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 don't destroy the field. Okay. Probably gonna be attacked by monsters anytime soon. Um... You are limited within uh, the borders on the island. I can explain further, but that would be spoiling. Just keep a, a check on the house icon below your EXP bar. Oh, cool, right. So, as soon as that disappears, that means... Ah, I see, I see, right. Cool, thank you for that tip. Um, yeah, because I kind of made this room a bit big, didn't I? But maybe we'll use that for something later. I could have built the barn over here, I suppose. I could do, but no, we'll have it over here. Uh, oh, then again, I kind of like the wooden look of it. I might go build some more wooden blocks instead. I just like the... yeah, we want to make it look good. Alright, Malroth, what are you up to, pal? Anything? Out and out? And I forgot I've moved my crafting thing over here. So... oh, what do you want? What do you want? Everyone else on the farm seems to be getting really good at making stuff. I mean, just look at all these crops. I think I might be able to make stuff too now. Um, okay, fine. Have a go. <laughs> Gotta be hitting it with a hammer stage down to a T. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, thank you, Jody. <laughs> I hope people are enjoying that because the game is not very fun. <laughs> And hello, Nostravel. Hello, hello. Um, you made a mistake of building a toilet outside the limit and learned the hard way. Damn. <clears throat> oh, you've been watching my Dark Chronicle videos, Velocity. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. I hope you're enjoying them. What? Oh, is he still not be able to make stuff? What a surprise. I just wanted to help, even just a little bit. Hey, Malroth, you're doing a good job killing all the monsters for me, okay? Yes, exactly. I like this first-person view. Right, so I'm gonna make a shit ton of soft wood. Uh, we'll make... Then again, it only needs to be a small room, doesn't it? So maybe just... We'll make 30. We'll make 30. We got, we got enough wood for it. And... Oh, we, you know what? Yeah, we'll make some floorboards, too. We'll dig out a foundation and put some floorboards in. <clears throat> hey, the yokai kid! Hello, hello! It's a lot more fun to watch you suffer rather than playing it myself. Oh, I can imagine. I can imagine. Uh, wooden grating. Water can flow under that. Okay. Um, I think straw would actually be more appropriate for a barn floor, but we're gonna go with floorboards now that we've made them. We'll make a rustic door. Or maybe... Yeah, we'll make a rustic door. And we'll make the other stuff once we've built the main part of it. So we're gonna build a barn over here. So I need to... 
get digging. Which is not that way. There we go. Do -do -do. Right, so... I don't know how big I want to make this really, but again, we can't make it too big. So... Let's see... One more line that way, I think. Damn it. Um... Gotta go. Oh, well, see you then, <laughs> Yokai kid. Thanks for the brief visit. Dante sleepy. Uh, what am I making? I'm making a barn. So let's plonk some floorboards down here. Make a nice little barn. I feel like Bob Ross <laughs> when he paints a little barn. I we'll have a happy little barn right here. Oh, I hate those ghosts. They're really tough. Malroth, I need your help. Villagers. Yeah, get stuck in, lad. Those things really suck. They hit hard. They have tons of HP. And they disappear, and... Come on, guys, get stuck in. Yeah, I hate these ghosts. They do make funny noises, though. Die. Ow. See what I mean? Look at that damage, dude. That was cray-cray. Alright, let's eat some cabbage. Okay, uh, scare him off with light. Okay, I need to make more torches, then. Oh, fucking hell, not another one. Although they do give good XP, though. I, I reckon I'll get level 5 if I fight a few more of them. I'm legit going in! I love Brittany. I love all the characters in this, goddamn. Well, oh, Brittany's not looking too good. What happens if your characters die? Do they just pass out for a bit and then you have to wait for them to respawn? I don't know. Ow. Come on, he's nearly dead, he's nearly dead. Oh shit, I'm nearly dead. Oh boy. Did they get him? Yeah, we are nearly level 5, cool. What I'm going to do, I'm going to quickly go to sleep. Because <laughs> I'll make the ghosties go away. Look at all the people sleeping. Get off my fucking bed, Clayton. It's my bed. I've already christened it. No, I don't want to talk to you. I want to go to bed. Piss off. Get off my bed. No, you little... Oh, it's fucking morning now anyway. Fine. Fine. Whatever. I don't want to sleep anyway. Uh, yeah, what's everyone doing? Um for this weekend. Anyone got any plans? That ghost is delighted burns! Nice! Yeah, we need more torches, don't we? Let's make some torches. Uh, did harm, did harm. Should have enough materials for... We could have... Uh... Oh, that's wall mounted, though. Yeah, we could, we could put some of those on our barn once we're done. Let's build a bunch of torches. Let's go for... Ten of them. This game's so relaxing, guys. I hope it's not too boring to watch. Let's plonk you over there. And oh yeah, do you like the fence that I built all the way around here, guys? Do you like my fence? Do you like my fence? Is it good? Do you like it? I like it. I like my fence. On there. Over yonder. One up there, randomly. We've got plenty of torches around that field. Yeah, I think that's probably going to be okay. We'll pop another one over here. It's kind of bugging me that that's not right next to the fence. There we go. 
I didn't steal that. Well, I did actually steal that fence. I did make some of it, though. I only stole some of it, Asami. I only stole some of it. Oh, you saw the new Lion King? How was it? Because that, Lion King, the original, is like my favorite Disney film. Uh, how, how was it? Lovely fence. We were all just having a private... Uh, con con uh, about how good the fence... Oh, I'm glad. I'm glad. It's a super nice fence. Okay. Let's continue our mission. Make a barn. Whoops. Sh oh, shit. Did I just... The hell? I thought I had more floorboards than that. Hang on a minute. I guess I don't. Okay, I'm gonna have to go make some more floorboards. It's okay. I mean, I could fill it in with some straw, but nah. We'll, uh, we'll make it look proper. That'll do. Next Friday, me and my friend are going to Skegness. We're doing some volunteering for the council, taking all people who don't uh, get to go out much around. No, we'll, oh, that's very nice of you, Jody. That is very, very admirable. It was alright, the original is still so much better. It's a straight up remake, nothing added to it, and some of the charm lost. Uh, that's my fear with these live action. <clears throat> live act. Why do people call Lion King, this new one, live action? It's all fucking CGI. Just call it the CGI one. Um. <clears throat> Oh, that's that's a shame. I'm sure I'm sure kids will enjoy it, but I just I kind of hope that their parents will still show them the originals because the classics. Right. Anyway, uh, so we got some. Actually, yeah, we can build the wall on the outside here. I'm hoping this won't. That's actually fine. Yeah, I do want it two levels, don't I? Do, 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 do. I love how fast he puts the blocks down. Oh, we're not going to have enough. God damn it. We're not going to quite have enough. Uh, ten more should do. Do, 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 do. A barn comes with a roof, so make a roof. I don't know. I can't make a roof right now. Well, I could, but it would look shit. Like, I don't have any roof pieces I can make. I'd have to steal some. I do have some, but I don't have enough. So... Um... Can you feel the love tonight is sang during the daytime? What? Are you serious? The fucking lyric says, can you feel the love tonight? Whatever. Oh, I still don't have enough. Shit. <laughs> That's so dumb. I hope people that do see it enjoy it, but yeah, that seems a little bit weird to me. Right, now we should... In fact... Yeah, no, that's fine. Um, let's pop... Still got some fence left. I'm going to put those away for now. Put the straw away. Keep the crispy kelp. Put the torches away. Alright. We've got plenty of food on us. In fact, let's eat some bread. Ooh, 30%. Damn, that's good. I mean, bread is pretty filling, so that does make sense. Disney just cashing in on that nostalgia. It would seem so. Alright, so we've just made a small room. Perfect. Perfect. Now we just need to fill it with shit. And the shit we need to fill it with is... Uh, some rope. Some firewood. Um... Farming tools, a pot, a pot, and haystack. 
Oh, and a chest as well. To fund the streaming service. Yeah, I mean, Disney owned the world at this point. You'd think they'd have enough, but hey, it's a business at the end of the day. And they do make good stuff, you know? I, you can't really... I don't know. I think the good outweighs the bad. If you ask me. Right, let's pop this haystack in the corner. Uh, farming tools right next to it, so that we can give that uh, hay bale a major ass forking. Even though there's no pitchfork there, it's just a shovel and a hoe. Um, are you actually searching for a needle in that haystack, Malroth? Are you insane? Pop the chest there. Uh, the firewood. And the rope. We made a small barn! Yeah! Alright, Clayton, you little div cheese. Are you happy now? Oh, yeah, you are. Christ on a bike, you are. Look at everyone. They're so impressed with my barn. Now I just wish that everyone would piss off so I could talk to Clayton. Hark can be praised. The barn is just as I imagined it. Ah, mage, I, I, I can't hide it any longer. Ever since I came to your farm, ever since I saw the wondrous things you built, I've fallen in love with building. There's no point fighting it. I just have to say my goodbyes to the children of Hargan and become a builder like you. Good to hear it, my man. Good to hear it. Evening, Ronin. Hello. Ah, oh, sorry, MJ. Sorry you have to work. That sucks. But I built a barn. <clears throat> if you have learned, the rooms can come in various sizes. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if people petition you for rooms for specific sizes in future. It won't always be easy, but you should do what you can to accommodate their requests. Anyway, as proof that I no longer serve the children of Hargon, I would like you to have these. What are you giving me? More kabar seeds. Okie dokie. And more wheat seeds. Wheat seeds. Right, we'll get those planted straight away. And then we'll have a chat with whatever his face is. Perry? Is that his name? Perry? All I can think of is Kevin and Perry. Kevin and Perry go large. Right, we might as well fill up this field before we move on to the next one. I reckon... We fall. MJ, thank you! Cheers to the adorable tiny town you're building. Oh, thank you so much, MJ. Holy crap. Hello, MJ. Thank you so goddamn much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Everybody, please thank MJ before she goes back to work. No, oh, I didn't... Oh, I ran out of cabbage seeds, so I planted a fucking wooden block in my field. Wonderful. Uh, wheat seeds. Oh, that is very, very kind of you, MJ. Cool. We have got a shit ton of veg to harvest. Uh, for a second there, the cabbages look like swastika. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I didn't see that. It's harvesting time! Oh yeah, I kind of see- actually, I kind of see it. That was unintentional, trust me. Please no one report me for that. <laughs> that was completely unintentional. Oh, Becca, thank you! Sorry I can't make more streams, thanks for the entertainment though. Oh, not a problem, Becca. I'm glad to have you at any stream you can make it to. Everybody has lives, and thank you so much for that donation. Thank you. Everybody, please thank Becca. That is incredibly generous. We have got so much fucking wheat. And cabbages. We're never going to go hungry again. Like, that was a big concern I had when I started playing this. I was like, food's going to be a problem, but nope, not anymore. Not anymore. <laughs> Asami, you do have a life. You work, you have family, you stream. 
You play video games, that's a life. You have to leave the house every day. I'm not, I'm not gonna make a roof. Not yet, anyway, until I can learn to make proper roof tiles and stuff. I'm gonna leave it as it is. Plus, it is just easier to see what's going on in there, too. Um, right, so... Um, I'll talk to Perry. What the hell is going on in there? Are they polishing the floor? They're totally polishing the floor! No way! Perry, get your ass over here. Everything's coming along nicely, mate. We've got our fields, we've got our cabbages, and we got our wheat. Make a position for roof stealing. Nostravel, you also have a life, I'm sure. Again, you probably leave the house. Uh, hunger pains, you know, how tummy those, um, how, how tummy, how yummy those cabbages are, but the rest of us haven't had a chance to eat them yet. What we really need on the farm is a chest full of food, then we'd all be able to help ourselves with something whenever we were hungry. Please, mate, I promise I'll never bother you anything, for anything ever again. That's going to be a lie. Just fill a chest up with 30 cabbages and let us see. Well, that's, that's piece of fucking piss, mate. Where am I going to put this chest, though? Should I just put it anywhere? Oh no, some monsters invading the base. Don't think so, pal. Don't think so. Let's do a spin attack. But missed. <laughs> I missed. Hmm, they seem to get over the fences way too easy. Maybe I should build them higher. Get off my bloody cabbages, you. Stop running away. Doodly loop. Right then. Um, over and cream for some cabbages. I'm going to put. The, well, I need to make another chest first of all. do actually since I'm not gonna go in the barn ever I might build a roof for it I might actually build a roof so let's make some more wooden things I'm probably gonna have to go collect some more wood soon um, yeah, let's make 30 of those Oh, I should really plant those uh, cabbage seeds, too. And the wheat seeds. Let's start over here. This this field will just be purely cabbage. And the other field will just be wheat. Because that'd be pretty sweet. <laughs> no. Plant the, plant the seed. There you go. Yeah, absolutely, Jody. I second what Cookie's just said. And I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> oh. oh my god. And Nostravel, I'm jealous. Of, uh, you seem to have a pretty good cafe. <laughs> oh. Bless me. Ah, oh, man. Whew. The thing, the only thing I did today, guys, was record. And uh, I went for a bit of a walk. That is about it. I'm gonna sneeze again. Oh, I'm so sorry. Where does all the sneezing come from? Ugh, ugh, ugh. Gross. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I don't have any bloody tissues in here either. I'm gonna have to go get some. Right, uh... Let's build a roof. And hopefully these torches will keep the ghosties away. What I'm going to do, I kind of want this to be a pretty tall barn, so what I might do, I might um, make it three blocks high. 
sort of, maybe. Whoops. Roof. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Roof back. <laughs> I'm not the best of builders, guys, I'll get used to it. Um actually. Yeah. I suppose it's whatever you want to do, really, isn't it? Okay, we have a roof on the barn. It looks terrible, but hopefully we can decorate it with some roof tiles at some point. I don't know. Kind of bugs me that it's not centered there as well, but hey, whatever. Um, ocean view for a cafe does sound awesome. Sneeze masher. Thank you, Wolfman. Bless you, mate. Thank you. And welcome to the stream. Okay, now that I've put a roof on that one, this one looks stupid. But anyway, we're going to forget that for now. We're going to forget it. We're going to pop a chest. Uh, we could put it in this room, I guess, for now. This can be where the food is stored. Let's pop some cabbages in there. Uh, let's put away... What was it, 30? I think he said 30, didn't he? 30 cabbages is a lot of fucking cabbages. There we go! Put some cabbages in a chest. That is an actual quest in this game. That's amazing. Uh, you didn't say another word, mage. I saw you squirreling away those cabbages for me. Uh, yada, yada, yada. Mm -hmm. Now we can grow our own food and stuff. <laughs> and stuff our gobs till we're fit to pop. By the way, mage, these uh, those seeds you've... Uh, planted won't last forever. Oh, once you've harvested them, uh, them enough times, they won't grow anymore. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, thank you for that info. That's very useful. <laughs> yeah, I guess. I guess. I can probably leave that other field alone for now. Cool. Yeah, we've got plenty of food. I do not need to do any more harvesting for a while. Ah, oh, look at the glow of the torches on my farm. I, I'm liking this. It's turning out pretty nice. Pretty cool. And hello, Stephen Overson and Ren. Welcome to the stream. I just raised my leg really fast and my knee hit the bottom of my desk. Freaking hurts. Oh, I've done that before, Asami. Many times, actually. Yeah. Many, 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 Okay, so we got a barn. Actually, would like maybe a torch or two around the barn. Uh, yeah, pop one there. And actually, that's okay. Maybe one at the back of the barn too. Plenty of torches. Ain't no ghosts getting in here. Although I would like to fight another one. If I venture outside, I wonder if I'll find one. Because I'm about to hit level 5. I'm very close. Any ghosties about? Typical. When you want a ghost to appear, they never fucking do. Oh, let's kill this poor sleeping slime. Oh, I feel bad. I feel bad for that. Uh, tea time. Hmm. Maybe the ghosts only appear when your farm's vulnerable. These goddamn snail. Sn snails? These goddamn snails! Nah, let's leave it then. Hippity hop. You know what we're gonna do? 
I'm gonna quickly ring the old bell. I know people might be trying to sleep, but screw them. Oh, did we just seriously just try and like? I thought we were trying to headbutt the bell. <laughs> that would be amazing. But no. Uh, next level residents will sow seeds. New residents will join the farm. Old recipes will unlock at crafting stations. Nice. Still got 490 hearts to go. <laughs> yes, fam. <laughs> I love Brittany. Oh, it's pissing it down. I didn't know it rained in this game. Hey, that. Hey, is that actually watering the field? It is watering the fields. Oh, we got. Ah, we do have a ghosty. Yeah, the light burns, bitch, doesn't it? Come on, everyone, get stuck in. Get stuck in. I'm doing all the work here. Where's he gone? Oh, did he vanish because of the torches? Son of a biscuit. Okay. Oh, hang on. Is this him? Is this him? I think it might be. Oh, no, it's a, well, either that or he got his health back. Come on. I'm gonna kill you. And... Yeah. Ooh. It's very, very handy having Malroth help you, though. That is a nice change from the original. To have someone constantly following you around. Nearly there, nearly there. Lone Wolf, dude, thank you. And yes, we got level five. Surprise stream, hit me, will you? Surprise donation, thank you, Lone Wolf. Everyone, please thank Lone Wolf. And I didn't care, Asami. I woke them up with that big bell. I did, goddammit. Oh, and Geeky's finally free and can chill. Clipped, clipped all my flatmates, graduations, so now we can all have clips of us. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice. And what are we going to get at level 5? Any new recipes? Oh, yes. Yaha! Yaha! We got a barbed blade. Ooh. Attack plus 28. I like the sound of that. I like the sound of that. What can I... What do I need to make that, though? Brambles. We've not come across them yet. I wonder where we're going to find those. Hmm. Ah, morning. Guys, I'm not an adult. I've got a paper that gives me letters on the end of my name. That's pretty cool. I don't have any letters. Oh. Ghost, go away. Has he gone away? Food, yay! Right, let's talk to Perry again. Perry, what do you want? Yeah. Got ourselves a proper little farm now, haven't we? It's blimmin' brilliant having a builder like you around. But more than anything, it's nice to have so much food. I could definitely get used to not being hungry all the time. <laughs> what? How do you guys also Asami hurt her knee? So it's a saw. Asam, oh my knee, oh my knee. That's terrible. <laughs> That's so bad. Wow. I mean, I have numbers at the end of my name. I have 22. Does that count for anything? Um. So what is he, is he going to, uh, what? I think we could invent something like, what? You need a way of eating that's a bit more civilized. Hmm. Oh, a table, maybe. Oh, he just wants the table and a stool. Okay. I was wondering what he was on about. And then a new culinary contraption. Oh, right. We're going to... Ah. Is this going to be like a barbecue? Hey. Or a grill? Oh, a simple supper set. 
Oh, it's just cutlery. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Don't need to eat cabbage with our hands anymore. I like this rain. Ooh, it makes me feel all cozy. Oh, the sound of the rain. You cannot beat that, can you? Right, okay, so let's... Um, I think a good spot for a communal eating area would be up here. I reckon we'll build something here. We'll build a table and uh, some stools. Look at them all munching on the cabbage. Right, so let's make a simple stool. Uh, you know what? We'll make we'll make two of those. I'm gonna have to go get some more wood. I'm running low on wood, guys. Uh, Asami, you are crazy. I just noticed, guys. Thank you, Asami. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, everybody. I mean, do I even need to say what you need to do at this point? Asami, you are... ...incredibly generous. I don't know why you do it. Alright, we got a supper set. Ain't nothing better than eating outdoors. Maybe not in this weather, mate. Alright, let's plonk. Oh, that is a really that is a really small table. Right, I guess a stool there and a stool here. Oh, yes, yes. We didn't need that other stool, but I like it there anyway. Great stuff. Thanks, mage. Now I can marvel at the wonder of nature without ever getting hungry. Still can't quite get my head around it. We tell you what we want, the next thing you know, you've invented something new and you're running off to build it. That's because I'm amazing. like shit. <laughs> In the face cap, I look so shit. You put something like a bed or a chair outside, we'll still use it, and happily too. Not to say we don't want you to make us nice rooms, we can enjoy our creations indoors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll have a bit of both. Um, anyone in town who sees that will know exactly what it's for. Jolly good. Oh, you want me to put some food in it? Mm-hmm. Well, we've done that quest anyway. You make your own goddamn food. Oh no, we got company. Oh no, it's like a big boss fight. Well, not a boss fight, but a big invasion. So we're gonna have to talk to Malroth and be like, right, we gotta defend this place. I was wondering when this would happen. Okay. Right then. I can smell when it fights Bruin Mage, and this whole place stinks of it. I don't know if it's the tree uh, you've grown, or that bell you keep ringing, but something's got the monsters in a seriously bad mood. Oh, well, thank you, Damien. Thank you. Yeah, maybe it is a boss, boss time. Are we ready to bash some baddies? I think so? Don't worry about the town getting damaged. We can always repair it once the fighting is finished. You mean I have to repair it, probably? Okay. Let's get out there and cause some carnage. Oh, this is just like the first game. Yeah, let battle commence. Oh, it's, there. oh, it's more of these guys. And I've missed them completely. Oh, they're going to cast a lot of spells. Oh, that's going to sting. Come on, guys. Nice. Ow. Uh, they're not doing too much damage. Ooh, bad boons. Yeah, we can tank these things. 38 XP. Not too shabby. I mean, the combat's very simple. It is very simple, but it doesn't need to be any more complicated than this, I don't think, really. I'm quite happy with it. Oh, 
still is more. Cool. Some slashy, spinny stuff on the go. Oh, yes. Oh, my lord. Get rid of the minions first. Everyone's holding their own, though. They're doing okay. It seems like those bad boons have, like, a super move that they do when they're nearly dead. Oh, God. Take down the big bastard. I'm guessing he's the last one. Ow. Oh shit, back off, back off. I like how everyone does. That's some pretty good AI. Probably better than mine. Oh gosh. Oh, we nearly got him. Oh, back off. Yeah, everyone runs away. Oh, Malros got caught though. The cabbage to be safe. And down he goes! We defeated the monsters. I know, right, Lone? I know, right? Um, I will donate on Sunday, Mage. I've got some money going into my PayPal account. Oh, you don't need to, Jody. Trust me, you don't need to. You do not need to worry about that. Just, you turning up is, is more than enough, trust me. Um, everyone all right? What is it? Uh, what, what's it to you? These monsters were for the children of Hargon. Called your friends over, did you? Mm. So we're blaming the, the pastor, are we, for that attack? You've heard of magic, though, Rosie? You've heard of magic, yes? Okay. No, I, I reckon the pastor's a good egg. Even if he wants us to believe that he's all heartless and evil. I see. Everyone did great today. Let's leave any uh, talk of tasks or missions until tomorrow. I think we've all earned... We've all had enough excitement for one day. I'm going to sleep with my head resting on a pillow of wheat under a warm blanket of cabbage leaves. As long as... You don't expect anyone to eat those afterwards. Cool. I'm not sure how you get milk in this game. Not sure. Still got a ways to go. Yeah, I mean, it's looking like a pretty impressive tree already. I don't know what the deal is. They don't like me, that's for sure. That's weird, they still seem to be in charge around here. There's something fishy going on on this island. The thing that gets me the most is everyone saying that builders bring destruction and despair. What's the story behind all that? Well, obviously they're sp spreading propaganda. Is he ever going to actually use a spell? Like, he always charges up his wand, and then he's like, actually, nah. Okay. So, what do we do next? Just do more quests? Oh. Okay, so, talk to the pastor. Before we begin build it, tell me, what are your thoughts about young Rosie? Her cheery outlook and irre irrepressible optimism make it all but impossible for me to maintain my dark and brooding demeanor. And so it is for her sake, as much as my own, that I ask you to tackle these next tasks. Come, my vassals, gather round. Cool, right, what's on the objective list for today? And he's apologizing for the attack. He didn't call the attack. Okay, I believe you. Oh, see you alone. Thanks again, dude, for the donation. <laughs> Doing a run off to bed. Sun's still out, you lazy sods. Uh... Oh, 
Oh, well, thank you very much, Jody. I, w I, I do appreciate it. But please, never feel like you have to. And that goes for everyone. Ooh, that's a very ominous purpley-pink sky. It's like a blood moon in um, Breath of the Wild. It's very similar, actually. What is going on? Oh no! Not more spoil spores! Shit, they're gonna ruin all of our hard work. And the more pop it, there are more popping up. No, stay away from my shit! Crap, what do we do? Yeah, we need to stop this. Alas, it seems the ill wind blows over Furrowfield once more. It has been some time since it last cursed these lands. This accursed storm is the source of the spoil spores. It was by this wind that so much of the soil on the island was ruined. Now hang on a minute. Do you mean to say uh, all this stupid storm's going to muck up all our hard work? That was terribly red. Yes. Everything was going so well. We, might, we have to do something. Yes, we do. What do we do? Um... we stop them from breathing in the... Oh, I know what they're gonna... I wonder if we have to build something around them. Like, just encase them in just a wooden box. Yeah. Block them in on every side to stop them breathing. Okay, then. Oh, well, we can just do that with the soil for now. I mean, that's kind of an ingenious method, don't you think? And then... Does that... It did! It worked! Oh, that is awesome! Oh, we got a seed for our troubles. Oh my goodness, it worked! Spoil spore is completely gone, you're amazing, mage! That is crazy! Right, I'll, I'll get to it. I will get to it. Yeah, see you alone. Thanks again, man. Uh, remember the old HP games, Ron? <laughs> yeah, been up, been up for ten minutes, done fuck all, and he's he's knackered. He's off to bed. Um, hey, Justin Tranberg, welcome to the stream. Uh, watching your streams this week convinced me to buy this game the other day. Ah, oh, fantastic. Do not regret it. Thanks for streaming, mage. Never forget the spider. <laughs> yes, the spider, which still hasn't been found, by the way. But I'm glad you are um, you went and bought the game and glad you're enjoying it. That is fantastic. Thanks. We could probably just get away with doing that, can't we? Yeah, we did. Thanks. Cool. This is certainly a different way of dealing with your problems, isn't it? Just bury it in soil, pretty much. There we go. <laughs> nice. They put one in my fucking barn. Are you serious? This is my barn. You see, this is why I don't build roofs. Now I can't fucking see, so now I have to do this. Which is fine. But that's why I don't like to build roof. Oh gosh, no. Shit. See, it's kind of close quarters in here. Now I can't get... Oh, I can't get over there. See? This is why I don't build roofs just yet. God damn it. Alright. I'll plonk you there. And then, boom. Okay, we did it. We saved the barn. And the last one is over here. Oh, part of our work's already done. Break the roof. Yeah, I might do, actually. We saved the farm, yippee! Thank you so much, mage. Not a problem. Yeah, we need to stop this ill wind. I do like the look of that sky, though. 
Uh, let's all go to the pastor, yes, let's have a word. But before I do that, I'm going to quickly plant these wheat seeds. And have a bit of crispy kelp. Save the roof. Every last one of the spoil sports has been eradicated, you say? If my understanding is correct, then... Uh, look, everyone, look at the sky! Is it going to fade? Is it going to go back to normal? <gasps> Yay! Blue! The wind's gone! Grumbling gremlins made you did it. Not a single square inch of our precious soil was spoiled. Very good indeed, Major. Your skills as a builder are remarkable. We, the children of Hargan, brought ruin to Furrowfield. We destroyed the deer tree. Uh, forbade humans from building and commanded them to join us in reducing buildings that were still standing to rubble. Okay. Then I saw that fragile sapling, the deer tree, reborn, and the irresistible force of life within it. Yada yada yada. I think, I think, uh, raging nerdbird, we just got to be a little bit ruthless. <laughs> it works both ways. You got to be ruthless to take it down, but you've also got to be ruthless because you're taking down the roof. Oh, anyway. So yeah, I, I love it also when it's here. It gives me life. I shall aid you, mage, in your quest to restore the deer tree to its former power. <laughs> yeah. Don't be doing that, Asami. You know that was good. You know that was good, okay? Hmm. <laughs> Geeky? You don't need to do that. Thank you so much. Consider this my own graduation present to you. Also, thanks for making content and being a great dude. Aw, oh, thanks. Thanks, Geeky. You're awesome, too. And hello, Blakely Forrester. Yes, you did catch the awful pun. I'm glad. Welcome to the stream. And thank you so much, Geeky. You really didn't need to. I appreciate that so much. Uh, right, so what do we need to do next for the day tree? I shall tell you what must be done to see the deer tree grow tall and true. Good. Grow lots of crops. Oh, you must grow crops of five different varieties. These fivefold crops must cover a total of 250 squares of soil. Yeah, we're going to have to go find some more seeds then. Yes. I suggest you work together to seek them out. Is there something you want to say? What? You think it's time I officially joined your fellowship? Yes, please. <laughs> there he goes again. <laughs> I jest, I jest. I would be glad to join. I like this guy. I like all the characters, for God's sake. If I am uh, to become a member of your village, I should introduce myself more properly. My name is Al. I am the pastor of this island. You may call me Pastor Al. Okay. How about Altruistic Al? No, I think perhaps we best stick with Pastor. Yay! We've got another friend. Do, 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 do. I had another white Twix yesterday. It was delicious. I'm kind of addicted to them. It's really bad. I mean, you can, you can pronounce it deity or deity. It doesn't really matter. White Twix are amazing. Jody agrees. Huh. Yippee! Pastor Al is officially a villager. I'm so happy. Uh, yeah, we'll have a big festival, I'm sure. Before we can start thinking about that, we'll have to find all the th uh, different seeds. Yes. 
Let the mission begin. Can confirm worst when melted. Yes, I can also confirm that because it's been hot as balls and I had two of them on my desk for pretty much an entire day and yeah, they needed to go in the fridge afterwards because there was no way I was, I was eating them when they were all just mushy. Yeah. Um, yeah, they are really good, Damien. I recommend them. Where the fuck is that? We got a dog! We got a farm dog! Have we always had this dog? Oh, a furrow field retriever. Well, he'll be able to point us in the direction of some seeds then. I have no idea how long she's been here. I guess she just turned up. Is there something over there? I bet she will. Let's go take a look. Yeah, we've not done some exploring in a while. Right. What I'm going to do first, I'm going to quickly ring the bell again, just because I feel like it. That's cool. I'm going to save, because I'm not saved in ages. Even though it probably auto-saved. Yeah. Um... Oh, yeah, I bet that was pretty warm. Ugh. Yeah, it doesn't matter which way you pronounce it, really. The pun still works. Alrighty-ho. Let's follow the doggy. Candy fun. Thank you, Burnt Cookies. Thank you so much. Cookies, you're a good egg. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That is crazy, crazy generous. Everybody, please thank Cookies. Let's go after her. Yeah, let's go over this way. Won't be long before level six. I want to find some brambles. Oh, I can't speak during a battle. And fucking snails. Okay, so we just got to kill any monsters that get near it. How long am I streaming today, Major? Just a question. Um, I've been going for about an hour, hour and 15 minutes. So, I don't know. At least another half an hour, I'd say. It depends. I mean, it depends um, if you guys want to keep on watching. Oh, we found a cave. Well, a sort of tunnel. Ooh. And a lot of dirty water, but we found brambles! Whoa! And reeds. Check it out, mage, this place is completely different to the rest of the island. Yeah, it is, and we found another navi globe. Yeah, I'm gonna go check out the navi globe. Don't you worry. Oh my god, look at those snails over there! Look at those snails! Oh, we got the the clouds floating about as well. Right, Navi Globe. So this is the banks of the bog. Very aptly named. What's a human doing here? Going on a picnic, are you? That'd explain the grin. You don't want to get lost here, so I suggest you touch this Navi Globe before heading further in. The fat rats and bodkins around here won't give you any trouble. In fact, if you're having trouble, it can't hurt to chat with one and see what uh, they have to say. Oh, okay. Alright. You know what I might... Ah, oh, I kind of want to go make that new sword. I'm going to go make that new sword. Hang on. We'll be back. Do, 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 do. I've actually just eaten. I had a bit of lasagna. But I'm still feeling rather peckish, so I'm probably going to have something once I've finished streaming. Right, let's go make that sword. Oh shit, I'm an idiot. I forgot to get the fucking bramble. <laughs> I forgot to get the bramble. Durr, I, I need the ingredients, mage. Silly sod. Alright, let's get the reeds. 
Take it, those brambles are gonna sting. Oh, we can't. Oh no, we can. We can just smack it. It's fine. Oh, big bramble. Don't know how many we needed, but I'm gonna take all I can get. That should do. Oh wait, we've got small, uh, big bramble and just bramble. Oh. Let's grab some of this then. Ow. Yep, it does sting. <laughs> don't run into it. Pro tip, guys, don't run into bramble. God damn it, I'm trying to avoid standing it. Alright, you know what, let's, let's, yeah, let's walk back and then we'll come back with the most powerful sword ever and we'll kill those snails. I'm sure the dog will be fine. The dog will be fine. Heading home now. Thanks for streaming, Mage. Bye, everyone. Okay, see you, Cookies. Thank you again. Safe journey home. Wrong thing. Yeah, let's get ourselves a barbed blade. I can give my sword, current sword, to someone else. So let's do that. Brittany's already got one. Who else wants this sword? Where have they all gone, anyway? Where is everyone? Well, I know how to get... Oh, hang on. Can I give this to you? Nope. I know how to get them all to come to me! <laughs> yes. Oh, you're all hiding in the barn, were you? Right, let's give you... Uh, can I give Clayton? Oh, yeah, I can give Clayton that sword. There you go. Oh, you already had a cypress stick. Oh my god, we're being attacked! Oh no! Killing these guys nice and quickly though. Don't destroy my town! Oh, you brought me fence, you bastards! God damn it. Oh, we've lost some seeds too. Never mind. Sons of bitches. Can't believe that. Um, I could kill for some ice cream. Some ice cream would be pretty nice right now. Put those away. So yeah, we're going to have to replace some seeds here. We're going to have to replace our goddamn fence. How, how, how wooed? What I might do, actually, is... Pop a fence on there. Pop a fence. Oh. Well, the tree's kind of in the way. I'm just going to put some fences a little bit higher. I don't know if that's going to help. Should do. They do seem to come from that direction, but then again, am I blocking my villages in a little bit? Maybe I should have a gate. I can make a gate, can't I? Yes, I can. Let's make a gate. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna plonk it right here. Yay, we got a gate. Nice. Cool. Sorry about that little bit of fence. 
Okay, that's looking a little bit more sort of fortified, kind of. Problem is, we'll still get over here. Alright, see ya, Jody. Sleep well. See ya Sunday. Alright. Um, Alright, so now that we've made that sword, I'm gonna head on back. I'm gonna quickly save it. I just like to save every now and then. Habit. Ah. Uh. Time flies when you play this game, it really does. Do, do. So, let's warp back. Take on those snails. Oh, they've disappeared. Oh, no. There they are. lot of snails, dude. Oh, they're probably gonna try and poison me with their shit. Ow. Ow. Yeah, they hit pretty hard. Oh no, it doesn't poison you, it puts you to sleep. Shit. Run! Oh, you still hit me. Ugh, look at the drool hanging off the tongue, man. Gross. Right, where's the dog again? Oh, there it is. Wait, where is he? Oh, he's here. Do, 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 do. Ah! Oh, what's this? Well, we got some people. What's going on here? Who are you? Oh, good little doggo. Ah, oh, that's okay, Becca. That's all. I mean, it sounds like you'd be pretty busy, honestly. Hope it goes well. So my course mates went out after graduation in spoons, so I ordered some random drinks they can have and sent them to the table. Am I a bad person? Not at all. Not at all. That sounds fine by me. Scruffy looking girls. I beg your pardon, I think you'll find we're ladies, not girls. And rather lovely ladies too, if I do say so myself. Children of Hargon threw us into this ghastly hole. They told us we had to reflect on our sins. Damn. And you couldn't get out. That is that is pretty That is pretty diabolical. And all you had was a little bit of shitty water. Um <clears throat> So so she might be a pretty good cook, eh? Uh-huh. Oh my, you say you're a builder? You're building a farm? With your friends? No, no, no. I've never heard such heresy. The children of Hogwarts... Yeah, 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 we've heard this all before. <laughs> Let's take him back to the farm and turn him into builders. <laughs> Lillian and Saffron. Very nice names. Yeah, we could walk you back there. Can we do it from inside the cave, though? I'm guessing that we're gonna bang our heads, aren't we? No! Okay, never mind then. I thought maybe we'd have to build them a staircase to get out of there, but maybe not. <laughs> Why was I punching the air? This must be our farm mage. It's simply marvelous. Must all have worked ever so hard to build it. It's almost enough to bring a tear to my eye. Assimilate them. 
damn, starting med school, that sounds like a big new chapter of uh, your life. Oh, you got some seeds? Yay! Yay! We've got some sugar cane. Oh, give me that sugar. Plant some of that sugar on me. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we're going to have to build, like... <laughs> I kind of feel bad if there's not enough beds for people, so I might have to, like, just throw a few around. Maybe build another building somewhere. I don't know where. I could maybe... Oh, I can't really destroy that, because that's where the water comes from. Uh, we'll figure it out. Ooh, lots of hearts. Hold on a minute. Um, yeah. Okay. Woof woof. Cool. It's very cozy in here, isn't it? Duchess Doggington? <laughs> Duchess Doggington. She's gone. Uh, I don't know. Oh, what's the pasta one? It's really getting pretty crowded in here, guys. Oh my god. Um, pat on the head. Provided you get within patting distance, so you can pet dogs in this game. Okay. I don't go. We gotta go pet the dog. But we can't run and scare it off. Oh, just as nighttime falls too. Ah, uh, we befriended the dog. A dog joins Mage's team. That's cute. I didn't know you could get a dog on your team. That's pretty cool. Uh, I think she's taking a liking to you, Mage. <laughs> Yeah, oh, did we get to call her? Did we get to call her a name? Oh. Ghoul Beast? Wait, no, Death Jackal? No, that's not, that's not fitting. We can enter our dog's name. What are we going to call our dog's name, guys? It's a female doggo. What are we going to call it? What are we going to call our dog? <laughs> any suggestions? Anyone got any spark of inspiration? Because I'm struggling a little bit. I don't quite know. Because it's a female dog, you see. I was going to maybe call it Max, but that wouldn't really work. You see, Rufus is a, f is a male name, though, Jim. Lord Woofer. Again, that's a... F we need a female name. Doge. Biscuit. Sand... Oh! Sandy. Sandy from Dragon Quest XI. Yes. We're gonna go with Wolfman's suggestion. We're gonna call this Sandy. That was the... That was the dog from Dragon Quest XI, wasn't it? Oh. Malroth likes it. Jolly good. Oh, look at the sky. I love that sky. This game's atmosphere is incredible. Have it your way. Uh, you're our friend now, Sandy, and friends stick together, so stay close. Oh, we got a dog following us. Sweet. Amazing. What do you want, Rosie? I did tame the dog, yes. Sandy's eager to help out now. Now that we've got a Furrowfield Retriever on board, we can, uh, our seed searching expedition can begin in earnest. <laughs> a special seed searching squad. Yeah. Sandy can be your guide. Pastor Al and I will be in charge of strategy and logistics, so that means you're not going to do anything. You're just going to stay at the farm and do bugger all. 
And Maoroth is going to be, of course, my security. Yeah, hitting stuff. <laughs> oh, is that right, Jim? Is that right? It's been a while since I've seen that film. Uh, the rest of the villagers can tend to them for the time being. You need to get out there and find those seeds. <coughs> yep, and I'm going to plant the sugar ones that I've got already. Pop them up here with the wheat. Okay. 92 out of 250. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna need a lot of uh, <laughs> a lot more planting, a lot more planting to do. So let's see. Uh, let's chat to Rosie again. I know you've just gone to bed, Rosie. I'm sorry. Finding more sugarcane seedlings. We'll need a few more than just a handful you got from Lillian. Bound to be some more seedlings in f in the bog, buried under the soil. If anyone can sniff them out, Sandy can. How are we gonna dig, though? I mean, can we get the shovel from the barn? I shall tell you what must be done with, uh, when the time is right. But before the seedlings can be grown, there is a particular tool you will need to acquire. Um. On a plateau above the bog stands my cottage. My servant is minding it. Speak with him and he will provide you with a pot that should prove invaluable. Okay, then we got to search. Get 25 sugarcane things. Right, so we're going to the pastor's cottage. Cool. Oh, and night time's falling, so you know what I'm going to do, actually. I'm for bed. I'm going to go have a kip. No, no, no. I... Bagsy this bed. I am going to have to make more beds. Ba -da -da. Oh. Good morning, everyone. Do, do. Let's see. So we're heading back. So yeah, let's teleport back to the bog. Yeah, there's a, there's always something to be doing. There's always something to strive for. Oh, we got some rats. Might as well grab this bramble while we're here. You never know when you're going to need it. I mean, I could probably kit out the entire village with those um, swords that I've got now. Uh, some bodkins are green. Sugarcane is green. Okay. Who are you and what do you want? Can't you see we're trying to have a conversation here? You're a weird one even for a human. Uh, Alright, be nice to him, Malroth. We need the help. We'll see about that. Someone needs to put you in your place. How about it, lads? Shall we teach Mr. Bossy Boots here a lesson? Oh no, 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 no. Damn it! I told you, Malaroth, we gotta be nice to things. Although they're actually super weak. I've squeaked my last. High five! Why wouldn't we resort to violence? That's the best bit. Don't worry, I went easy on them. They'll come back around, probably, soon. Sooner than, uh... Sooner than soon. Uh, right then, so where are the seeds? I am looking for sugarcane seedlings. Um, buried all around the bog. With a dog like that, you'll have no trouble finding them. She'll be able to sniff them out like a mouse sniffing out cheese. Try the other side of that tunnel over there. Which tunnel? What? F oh, that tunnel. Oh, we'll have a good look around. Yeah, we need to go to the cottage. What? Where is that going to be? Sandy the Miracle Dog. 
I'm not... I'm, Malroth is the bully. He started it. Sorry we start... Well, actually, they technically started it, but, um... I have no idea your friend will be so strong. You're lucky you've got him around to protect you. Um... Cool. Yeah, that's what we need. Right, so that's added to our map. Excellent. And you saw a Bodkin Archer over to the west. He seems to be having trouble with something. Perhaps he needs help. Yeah, we'll go have a word with him. Right, so we got multiple uh, destinations. Okay. Both of them seem quite a ways away. Sandy's got the got the scent. It was yeah, counter bullying exactly, Jim. Exactly. Exactly. Oh god, I am actually getting pretty tired. Oh. Hey, mate, do you think you might have smelled something? Yeah, she might smell something. Let's we'll see where she goes. Have to deal with these snails, though. In fact, we'll... Dig in the water, eh? Fruit friend stops in the tracks. Start barking, she might have found something. Yeah, yeah, okay, we'll dig. We'll dig with our hammer. Because that makes sense. Ow, fucking brambles. Okay. Ah, perfect. Do 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 do. Don't open your mouth, that water is definitely not sanitary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No idea. Right. Let's get cracking. Wrong block. Oh, yes, yeah, Sandy, I see it, I see it. Okay, that's 13. You gonna find any more, Sandy? I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill these things. Oh, beautiful couple of crits there. And level six. Yeah. You gonna learn anything new? Being all these bandits is great. We keep getting stronger and stronger. I feel like I could clobber monsters all day. Speaking of clobbering things, Mage, when you smash up blocks, isn't hitting them one by one with your hammer kind of slow going? It is, actually, yeah. Ooh. Do tell. Do tell. First, swing your hammer over your shoulder, same as always. Like that, yeah. Oh, so how do I do that? <laughs> Big Bash. <laughs> cool, so how do I do that? Press triangle while holding R2 to perform a Big Bash. A stonking strike that'll break blocks like a hammer through jelly. And I've got a new recipe as well. Yay! That is super helpful, Mike James, you're right. A spiked club, which... Um, will make for Malroth, hopefully. She probably is going to use the brambles again, I would imagine. But, um, that's awesome. Cool. Let me try this, then. Oh. Oh, because I wasn't holding... Oh, I see. Uh. Boom! Now that's cool! I like that! That is going to speed things up if I remember to use it. Right, there are any more? We need more sugar cane, guys. You know what, though? Yep. Get that bramble. Oh, my horse is going for a swim. Oh, shit! Ooh! Interesting. They dropped grass fiber. Oh, that was 
a beautiful airstrike. Oh, we got another scent. Kill the snail first, though. Slash him right in his eyes. Let's get digging. I probably could have just... You know what? Let's let's try that. Yeah, sweet. It does look like I'm smacking Sandy there. I do apologise. Whoa! Right, have we got all the sugar cane? I think we must do. Oh no, hang on. Hang on a minute. Let's all get more. Oh, 23 out of 25. Okay, we're nearly there. Nearly there. Only there was more in this spot. What about over here, Sandy? You smell anything? Anything over this way? Oh wow, now that is quite the location. That is quite the location. What about over this way? Oh, yep, she's found something. Oh, shit. We got company. And we got all the sugar cane needed. Judging from that dopey grin on your mug, I assume we found the 25 sugar canes. Uh, yeah, we're going to head to the cottage now, I think. Might as well grab the other sugar cane things, though. Be silly not to. Alright, Sandy, I know, I know. As bad as bloody Max. I love Dragon Quest monster designs. Yeah, me too. Me too. Right, so now we just need to find our way up to the... Oh, there's something glowing in there. Ooh, let's go have a look at that. Is that another puzzle thing, maybe? Might as well kill some of you guys, try and get some... medicinal leaves. Still being attacked. Whoops. What is this? Oh, it's another Navi Globe. Sweet. Well, that saves us a trip. Clifftop Cabin. I am gonna have to. I'm gonna eat something. Let's have some like kelp. Um. Oh hey, you left terrace. Welcome to the stream. I I also love the fact that, for the most part, all the monsters are pretty much the same. They add new ones here or there, but they're all just so instantly recognizable. And they're not too like complicated either. They're, they're kind of simple designs, or at least a lot of them are. Simple and charming. Right, now, this guy isn't going to give over the pot just out of the kindness of his heart. He's going to want something doing. And uh, maybe I can steal the roof while I'm here, guys. Who knows? Yes, this is the pastor's cottage. I'm minding it for him while he's away. You say you sent him to collect a special pot from me? <laughs> Before anything else, let me have a good smell of you. There's no fooling my sensitive nose. I have been building, yes. What? I admire your honesty, but surely you know that building is forbidden. Do you truly expect the children of Hagen to overlook this most heinous of crimes? Either way, it matters not. Your ill-gotten gains are forfeit. All of your crops you have grown are to be surrendered to us. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Your boss is kind of on our side now, so... 
Oh, look, there's a well, too. Um, ah, the back of the pastor's cupboard, you say? Oh, you want 50 wheat? Oh, I've already got that. I've already got plenty of wheat, mate. There you go. Never before have I seen a more enticing sight, nor one so wicked. Yeah, we would. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, you'd need food still. Surely monsters need to eat as well. Well, 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 would you look at that? I am going to steal all the things from his cabin. I might even steal those banners, they look pretty swish. The Overseer of the Island, the Primate of Furfield, shall be returning here soon. I only hope the pastor returns to us for... Ooh. Hmm. Sounds scary. Pot is yours. Will you be dashing it to the ground immediately or saving the pleasure for later? Uh, yeah, m much, much later. Totally gonna do that. Oh, a scoop of water and slosh it out. The bottomless pot. We look super happy to have it. Mm -hmm. We could technically steal the whole cabin, probably. Master the wet stuff with this impressive vessel. Tap R2 to scoop up water around you, and then hold R2 to pour it out again. Right, so... I wonder... what the purpose of that is. I mean, probably just for, like, watering more plants, or maybe... transferring water to create your own water source? I don't know. Some guts waltzing up here, human. This house belongs to one of the higher ups in the children of Hagen. Uh, what do you want to eat? Cabbages and sugarcane seedlings. Oh, I have ten. I have ten cabbages. Yeah, sure. There you go, pal. Bunch more seeds. Oh, Thirty-five sugarcane seeds. Wonderful. Uh, all right. Quest done. I've been wandering around so carefree if I were you. This island doesn't belong to humans anymore. It's the children of Hargens now. Whatever. Du -du -du -du. Ten, you want ten wheat as well. Okay. That's fine by me. There you go. Thank you. We got forty now. Sweet. Get it? Because it's sugar. Sweet. Right, let's, uh, we got the pots. Is there anything in here I want to st uh, steal? I mean, uh, borrow. Oh yeah, he's got water in his house. Let's go up the ladder, shall we? Before I steal it. <laughs> Ooh, I like the look of this wall. I do, I like the look of Oh! I like the look of this altar. I might have to... Splash it with water. No, 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 no. Oh, gee! Where did that table and candles go? Oh, no! I, I, I didn't see where they went. Gee. Things just disappear in this place. It's crazy. That's crazy. As well as... These, um... Oh, I, I did just get a banner, too. Sweet. Just, you know... Uh, oh, and this... Straw door. Where did that go? Oh my god. Hey, Blacklight Sun! The sugarcane probably has to be grown underwater like rice. That is a good point. I didn't think about that. But it did let me plant it in the field. Didn't it? I did plant some already in the field, so I don't know if that's going to grow or not. But I guess we'll find out soon enough. Um... But I didn't realize, I thought sugarcane just grew normally. But then again, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not a farming expert. Uh, anything out here? I kind of want to get up to the roof. Can I get up to the roof? Well, I could. I could just build my way up there, I guess. Oh, 
in fact, yeah, can't I do that trick? Uh, whoops. There we go. I'm gonna steal myself some roof tiles. And I don't care. Oh, and windows too. Oh, I could take a chimney. Oops, I actually wanted to just like... <laughs> break it. I'll put the spoiled soil away, whoops. Let's, um, let's put the candles away, put the table away, the door. Use my big bash, yep. Yeah. I'm gonna try. Oh, damn. Someone's someone's already beat me to it. Someone's already been here. Alright, so. Okay, yeah, I mean we'll just have to collect it from inside. That's alright. <laughs> Sorry, Sandy. Whoops. Break all the... <laughs> Fuck this guy's cottage. Sorry, Malroth. My bad. We're taking all this, man. Well, we're not taking all of this, but... Like, as much as we can. So, Stoon. Diddy, diddy. Just gotta be careful, though, now that we, we have less roof to stand on. I mean, that's a lot. That should, that should help build at least one roof for a building. Like the barn. Maybe. <laughs> Save the roof, you're not going to even use it anyway. No, I might do. I might do. Oh, wow. Look at this view. Oh, my God. That is beautiful. That is real pretty. I think that'll do. I'll do for my roof stealing for now. Um. Okay. I don't know what business do I have with you. You thought I looked like I had a job for you, so you're offering to help. Perhaps I misjudged you. Could it be that you are not the violent evil being I previously... I really hope his job isn't to fix the cabin. I really hope that's not what I have to do. Wouldn't that be just the funniest thing ever? <laughs> oh, man, I really hope he doesn't want me to fix the cabin. <laughs> we'll see, won't we? Um... Oh, reservoir. Okay, maybe not. Maybe we're okay. The water's, uh, oh, that's what we're going to have to use the pot for. I'll have to get some water up here. Alright. Collect the water, use it to fill the two areas I mark out for you. Okay, we can do this. Right, so, let's go grab some water. Some water. Screw you, Mr. Chimera. Right. Scoop. Oh, wow, it actually gets rid of the water. Oh. Interesting. That's interesting. Right, let's get back up. I don't know if we've got enough water. Guess we'll find out soon enough. What a wonderful pot. <laughs> yeah. That would have been... That would just be my luck. Oh, 
but that would have been a bit of a task, especially for this early in the game, so, yeah. Right then, so let's just... Uh... Whoops. How do I... How do I put the water in there? Again, I forget. Oh, sod off, Chimera. Trying to do stuff. Right, how do I use the pot again? Yes. Yeah. Once your pot is filled with water, simply hold R2 to pour it out wherever you... Okay, hold it. Right. Got ya. Got ya. Yeah, Kirby Pink. That's the kind of thing I do. That's the kind of thing I did in the first game. Alright. That's full of water. And finally... There we go. That literally was a piece of piss, because that water looks like piss. Ah, the Wayward Child returns, and I notice the reservoirs have been refilled with water. I take it uh, we have you to thank for that. Don't you worry, we won't tell him a thing. Thanks for the seeds. Oh, that pot's going to come in handy. I could drain the entire ocean, couldn't I? Oh! What have we learned? A sluice gate. We can make a sluice gate? Oh, cool. We can make some proper, like, intelligent irrigation. If only I was interrogated. Uh, in <laughs> if only you could talk proper. Um, I kind of kind of want to steal this well. But I'm not going to. I might take these banners, though. Then again, is there any point? Nah, we'll leave. We'll leave for now. Ooh, fence, though. We'll take the fences. Oh, no, no. Take the fences. Shh. No one say a word. No one say a word. He wasn't using them anyway. He wasn't using these fences. They're my fences now. Cool. Kill the ocean. Right then, so I guess we could warp back to the farm now. Yeah, we'll do that. And I might call it a stream there, chaps. We've been going for two hours now, pretty much. And uh, yeah, I just want to thank everyone for watching. Thank you so, so much. Oh, you speak very good. Me, good English. Alright, let's quickly hand in this quest. Made you back and looking happier than ever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, ah, now we can begin work growing the sugarcane seedlings. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, good luck with that, Rosie. No problems, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. Sunday people are going to be confused. Well, they know that there's been two more streams. So they'll see it. In I've got a playlist for it, so... If people do want to catch up, they can do. But I don't think in this kind of game... Unless you really super, like, want to follow the story along, which at the moment there isn't too much. I think, uh, I don't know. It'll be fine. So I'm going to end it there, guys. Thank you very much. Before I do go, though, I want to do a quick rundown of every donation. So thank you to Asami, uh, Burnt Cookies, Geeky, Lone Wolf, Becca, MJ. Am I missing anyone else? No, oh, I think we're good. I think that's it. Yeah, so I've already got the dog. Already got the dog now. Dog, dog's called Sandy. Save the ocean. Um, now I'm going to be streaming on Sunday. I probably won't be able to stream tomorrow. So, yeah. Um, although Asami apparently might be streaming this tomorrow. So, um, if you're not following Asami on Twitch, you probably should be. Uh, I don't know if Asami wants to... In fact, I don't know if she can post a link, so I might do that quickly. 
before I go. Should be fine. Yeah, go go to that link. Give Asami a follow, and she'll be streaming some of this uh, more later game stuff tomorrow, probably. Um, I don't really have a schedule for my Dragon Build. There's two streams apart from every Sunday around three o'clock my time. So there'll be an announcement for that soon. Um, but yeah, I don't really have a schedule, it's just whenever I'm in the mood. So, so yeah. Thank you guys, enjoy the rest of your night, or day, or whatever time it is where you are. Hope you have a great weekend, and uh, it'd be great to see some of you on Sunday. So, stay safe, and uh, ciao for now, I guess. <laughs>